Hey everyone, it's Rek here and in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to optimize your PC with Outbyte PC Repair software. So I have been using this software for quite some time and recently they hit me up and asked if I want to make a video about it. Well, from all of the tests that I have done with this software, of course I said yes. And here I am making this video. But before moving into the video, you guys know that making these videos takes a lot of time and effort. So a like would really mean a lot to me. And also if you guys are new to the channel, be sure to hit the subscribe button to get a free cookie. And trust me, it works. So with all of that out of the way, let's get this video started. So what is Outbyte PC Repair? Basically, it's what their tagline is. Clean, speed up and protect your computer with Outbyte PC Repair. Outbyte PC Repair is a software that can help you improve your gaming experience on your PC by making it more optimized. Some key features of Outbyte PC Repair are Number 1. Disk Decluttering Outbyte PC Repair scans and removes all of the junk files on your PC which are no longer required by your Windows, which in itself can give you tons of more free space. It also has an uninstaller tool, which strives to uninstall programs on your PC completely with no traces left. It's like the Windows uninstaller but a more powerful version. Number 2 is boosting the performance of your PC by optimizing different settings which can be really useful if you guys are using a really low end PC. Moreover, it scans and removes PUPs, potentially unwanted programs, which all of you guys know is really important for your PC stability. Outbyte also secures your privacy and will warn you guys if you stumble across a malicious website which can protect you gamers from a lot of scams. And if you guys are using a laptop, then Outbyte can prolong the battery life of your laptop while using the battery power tool. So to download the tool, go down into the description of this video and click on the link for the Outbyte PC repair, which will take you to their official website. You can read more about the program here and how it can help you. But once you guys are here, go ahead and click on the download button and start downloading the program. So once you guys have downloaded the software, it will look something like this. So just go ahead and run the setup. Then hit yes. And the installer will open up. All you need to do is click on install. And that's it. It's really simple to install the software. And once it is installed, we are going to be launching it. So the installation was complete and we are going to be launching the PC repair software. So click on finish and the PC repair software will open up. It's going to scan, so it's going to take some time because it's going to deeply scan all of the system specs, app crashes, junk files, and uh, other privacy stuff. So it's going to take some time, so be patient about that. It took some time, but the scan is finally completed and it has actually detected like 934 items that need to be fixed. Most of them are from the privacy protection. So I'm assuming those will be all of the cookies and stuff that remain on the website. So that's pretty good to know and I'm gonna quickly go through all of these and see what are the problems that it has detected and what are the fixes that it's going to apply. The interface of the software is really clean and simple and it's really nice and easy to navigate. So that's actually another plus point of this software. All of the stuff inside of here is really detailed so you can always know what to do and what not to do. Okay, so I just saw this real-time boost and it's going to enable the boost games, boost office and outlook and Skype etc, boost web browsing. So this is actually a really important setting which is which it is going to apply automatically. So we don't have to do anything, we will just need to start repair but before that I want to check everything that it has detected and what are the things that it's going to fix. So I'm just gonna go ahead and click on start repair. Once we do that, it's going to automatically repair all of the items that it has detected which is going to improve the overall performance of your PC and also fix any of the issues that you could be having with your windows. Okay, so the repair was completed and I think you guys will actually need to activate the software before repairing. So if you guys want to do that, I will leave a key in the description down below, which will be actually a 7 day trial key. After that, you guys can go ahead and buy this software for 29 bucks and 95 cents, which is a fair price for a software with all of these tools. So to activate the software, you guys will need to go into the settings 
into the help actually and then click on register I have already registered the program so just go ahead and paste that key inside of here and you will be registered once all of that is done you can go into the power tools and use the uninstaller app to uninstall any of these softwares this will actually remove all of the leftovers as well which will clear up a lot more space you can stop pop-ups from different websites and for the speed boost, always turn on all of these settings, it may lead to improved system performance. For the privacy, set all of the settings to enable as well and hit apply if you haven't already. All of this will help you guys beware of scams and going on unprotected websites. You can also check the status of your PC and make sure that speed for Google Chrome as well as your Nvidia or AMD card is on and everything in privacy is also boosted. When closing the program, make sure that you guys go ahead and exit the program window and it will keep running in the background which will keep optimizing your PC. So yeah guys, that was it for this video. I really hope that you guys enjoyed the video and it helped each and every one of you. If it did, be sure to leave a like down below and also subscribe to the channel if you haven't already for more and new upcoming content. Be sure to connect with me on Twitter and join the Discord server. All of the links can be found in the description down below. If you need help with anything, DM me on any of those platforms and I will be sure to reach out to you. So with all of that said, I will end this video right here and I guess I'll see you guys in the next one. Until then, stay awesome.